Adio, here's Wednesday. Uh, good one. We've got some overhead related stuff, whether it's snatch balance or overhead squat. If you don't have overhead related kind of equipment on you, you'll be doing a weighted squat, which is cool. Mix up with some hollow holds. Uh, then we've got an AMRAP, some short runs, so 100 meter runs, power snatch or dettlebell, as dumbbell or kettlebell snatch, and then some hand release push ups. Good one. For the warm up, seven minutes. A bit longer one, just get everything loosened up. We want our shoulders and all that sort of thing to be nice and active and ready um, and primed. So we're going to do a 100 jog, followed by our five dislocates, followed by some behind the neck press. So in snatch grip, press out, tummy locked down, not open. Cool, hold it tight, feet are um, tight through here. Then we're going to try some overhead squats with our broom. Again, keep this locked down. We don't want to come down and then open. Okay, hold it tight the whole way. If you can't get depth without it opening, don't go to depth. Go to here instead. Okay, go to where you can hold a good position. Cool. Then we're going to try some snatch balance, which will be some fun. So our feet are a bit closer. We do a little dip and drive. And then we receive at the bottom of the squat or whatever is bottom from you. So from here, dip and drive, catch. Dip, drive, catch. Okay, so the amount of leg power, boom, dictates the air time the bar gets. From there, we drop. Okay, we are not jumping, pressing, and then dropping. We are jumping, dropping. Cool? Jump, drop. Not jump, press, drop, ride down. Sweet? And then lastly, some good mornings. Cool? Bow. Oh yeah, feel some leg work from the last couple of days. Oh, decent, decent. Cool? Bow, come up. Do that for seven minutes. Okay, onto the load. So as we've just done, snatch balance. You obviously need a bar for this one. Oh, you could do single arm dumbbell kettlebell with that. I don't think I've ever done it before. I'll start with the light one. Oh yeah, you can do it, but you need to be already good at a single arm overhead squat. So you can just move to an overhead squat. So once again, if you don't have a bar, you can practice dumbbell or kettlebell. Overhead squats, which is super hard, but hey, it's a good fun challenge. You've got some good flexibility through here and you warm up well through here. Do some extra stretching and opening through your chest and that. Then bang, we can do single arm overhead squats. Really fun, really good for your core. If not, any type of weighted squat you want to do, okay? Goblet squat, racked up on shoulder squat, mirage squat, squat, cool. It's only three reps, so if you can make it heavy, go for it. Um, but look, if it's light and you're not doing overhead, up the reps, do six, do, do nine, do 12, totally up to you. Um, that'll be it for squats, there's nothing to work out too. So if you wanna bump it up, bump it up. Then you move to a hollow hold. That's where we're hitting the floor. And shoulders off, rounded lower back, hold one of these positions. Don't lose your back. Okay, we've worked on that before. We want this flat against the floor, holding tight. Okay, don't hold this because you think it looks cool, but you're actually open and you look like a flat pancake. Okay, we want that rounding. 30 second hold. Sweet, five sets, three squats, 30 second hold. Cool. Onto the workout, run first. 100 meter run, it's short. So it's, what, 20 to 30 seconds worth of running. So if you're rowing, do that. If you're on a bike, just do one hell of a bike sprint, quick 30 second sprint. Um, you can skip it if you need to do skipping. Um, you could do fast box jumps or step ups or even burpees as well. So if you're not running, there's lots of alternatives to running. Just something that gets your heart rate going, cool. Then we'll move on to power snatch. So if you've got a bar, 10 reps, that will be from the floor, jump, catch, stand up. Hey, hang on. This is how I'll fix it. Hey. There we go. So back to that position, chest up. Wait, 
more forward, steady, push through the legs, get to your hips, jump catch, okay? Steady, oh. Dumbbell, kettlebell, same as well, drive. Like we've said with the kettlebell, treat it more like the kettlebell swing with the shrug and punch. Swing, shrug, punch, as opposed to from the floor, because it ends up like this and it's a bit awkward and weird, okay? Or you can do your alternating dumbbell snatch. Lastly, hand release push-ups. Move you guys back down again. Floor, hands off, hands on, press. Floor, hands off, hands on, press. And do it on your knees, same thing. Down, press, okay? We'll be strict there. Try not to let your tummy sag when you do that though, to make up for the hand release. Hold it tight, tight, press down. Cool? That's the workout. Beautiful, good stuff. Seen in videos, there's some cool skills here, so especially snatch balance, you're unsure, shoot some stuff, practice it. Practice it today or tonight, so you're ready to go for tomorrow.